All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is this is interesting to me. All right, this this is something that really does shed a lot of light on the nature of women and the mindset of what I like to believe most women feel in reference to the man that they're dating. Now, big salute to one of my favorite YouTubers in recent months, man. His name is uh, Mediocre Tutorials and Reviews. He had this posted in his community tab, and I just had to talk about it because it seems to shed a lot of light, and it seems to say a lot of things that a lot of men have been saying forever. And in hindsight, we like to believe that comments like this don't necessarily transcend to the Philippines, but then again, I just believe and a lot of guys have said this, um, that it does go to the nature of women. I think one of the main individuals that I can remember off the top of my head that have been saying things like this was my man, um, my man Channel 19, big love to him, and also my man Charles, Charles Merchant. He was, he, he was one of the bigger advocates. We even talked about it on a live stream one time many moons ago about this particular semi-topic of conversation, but... Of course, you probably read it already. The comment reads, I'm glad that my guy doesn't have other women, a hoes. <laughs> but she then questions, why does he not have other women? And is she fighting for a spot that nobody wants? All women want a man that is taken. All women want a man that is desired by other women. That way, when they win, or when they're in charge, or when they get the spot, or the top spot, they can show all the other women, I got the top spot. <clears throat> and it makes perfect sense. So, when we talk about the competitive nature of women, the shit's for real. <laughs> it is legitly there. There is a competition with women, and this is all over the world, ladies and gentlemen. This isn't just in the United States. This isn't just... In the Philippines, this isn't just in Japan and other parts of the in other parts of specific areas. This probably is true in any part of the world. Because what threw me off and what really, really made me want to make this video was you see the Filipino flag next to her name? I thought it was a Filipina at first. And I mean it might be a Filipino American Philom. I don't know. Don't know who she is. Don't really care who she is. I saw the flag and I was like, wow, this is a Filipina saying this. Now again, mannerisms, the way she grew up may alter people's opinion on what she's saying, but guys, let's not overlook the simple fact that all women, for the most part, want a guy that is desired by others. They want guys that other women want. And it's weird because it does go to the ideology that some are okay with being number two or number three as long as they're part of a lineup of women that are wanted and desired by one man. You might get this more so with your rappers and more so with your entertainers and more so with the guys that are making a lot of money, but for your average Joes like myself, I still think the same rules could apply. It just depends on what the criteria is. If somebody looks at me and says, you know what, I see people commenting or I see women commenting on his videos or, I mean, he seems like the one that these girls want. Let me try to get in the mix sometimes. You know, it may be something as simple as that. But it's just crazy to think out loud that you have women in the world today. It's not, I'm sorry, it's not too far-fetched, but it's just, it's just different to see it written in plain sight. Although it's probably been written and phrased so many different ways, now we see it. And if you are a young lady, I would love to see your opinion on this. Please leave it down in the comment section below. This does not necessarily just have to be my gentleman commenting on this. I prefer a woman's perspective on this, on what this lady said in the post. Because again, you need to be able to prove to me that she's wrong. Now, again, it might be isolated. It might just be for her, but I've seen something like this before on probably quite a few occasions. That's what's really prompting me to say this. Women probably do want and desire men that are already in relationships. That's something that Across the board, I agree with. I've never denied that. I never said anything like that. But the idea of being okay with being a second or a third in line, I always thought, yeah, that doesn't really fit the bill, especially with Filipinas. But then again, 
there have been certain things that I've seen that have really changed my mind about it. So let me know what you guys think, man. Leave it down in the comment section below, man. I'm going to I'm gonna try to put out more videos like this because I think that is, this is very noteworthy. And this is something that we can really talk about. In this particular post, although it's just from one young lady, okay? It's just from one. Isalang. I think that the way she's phrasing the questions in this particular post could definitely be a part of the mindset of more than just her. More women probably think like this than not, in my personal opinion. But tell me if I'm wrong in the comment section below, ladies and gentlemen. This could apply to women across the board. Not necessarily from any particular country, but if you are a woman from, from a specific country, let me know what you think. All right? It's been a good Dr. Mike TV. Y'all take care. God bless. Doc is out. Peace.